This is a motor. It runs on electricity. All electricity excess solar power is produced by rotating generators. Nearly half of the all produced electricity is used on electric motors. So we need generators and motors to run motors and machines everywhere. There are coils in every electric motor. Wire around the magnetic core is traditionally made of copper. Copper is a valuable heavy metal that could possibly be replaced with the material that is more easily available. What if we could replace copper in electric machine with carbon, which is, in principle, abundant everywhere? Rice University and Tejin Aramid Corporation developed a spinning method for carbon nanotube yarn conductors. This strong new material conducts electricity well and has potential to outperform copper in conductivity. Professor Juha Pyrhönen from Lappeenranta University of Technology received carbon nanotube yarns from Tejin Aramid's Dr. Marcin Otto. Pyrhönen along his team developed and built an electric motor with carbon nanotube yarn coils. I think that this innovation has potential to significantly increase the performance of electrical machines in the future. There are clear advantages which could be got by using carbon nanoconductors instead of copper in the machines. I think that there is a great potential to change the whole industry. Now, as our small test machine runs nicely, it calls for further innovation and research. This innovation has potential to significantly improve the performance of generators and motors. The future advantage of replacing copper with carbon nanotube yarn are undeniable. Carbon conductors have potential to change the whole industry. As the business manager of carbon nanotube yarns, I am excited about business opportunity coming with the vision of Professor Pirhonen. Now we have to scale up and the group of Professor Pirhonen has to do R&D work. Now, when the nanotube yarns winding electric motor runs, further research is possible and essential.